Hi, my name is Dave. I'm 21 years old, and I hate recycling. Global warming, pollution, who cares? We're all gonna die anyways. It's just a big conspiracy theory. It's just a bunch of companies like Walmart and all that crap trying to just get their materials back. I say screw it and suck it, chump. These are all my outstanding tickets right here. They add up to about, let's say around 15K. My goal is to get a ticket for littering in all 50 states. Dave has over 440 littering tickets racked up through 41 different states. Recycling is just a scam. The big companies just want you to give their materials back so they can keep business costs down. You have to follow the money to see the truth. Even if you throw it away, it all just goes back to them. Excuse me, young man. Can I help you, Grandma? You can't leave your trash around all willy-nilly. Oh, yeah? And who's gonna stop me? Recycle this. Ow! My hair! Um, this right here is my stockpile of trash. Sometimes when I get angry or when I just feel like it, I go outside and I just throw it. Just throw it out in the bushes. I like to litter. It's about personal freedom for me. What do you think about animals eating your garbage and dying? What are you talking about? Trash just like turns into dirt or something. Actually, it can take thousands of years for plastic to be No, no, that's a myth. I saw it on Facebook. Yeah, and it can get into the oceans and create microplastics that are really are you sure? I think that's just what the left wants you to think. Here, look at these pictures. These are real? 100%. They're not propaganda? I actually took these pictures. We show Dave images of pollution all around the world and the impact that his littering has on the planet. Look at how sad these are. A turtle caught in a net. Elephants caught in a pile of trash. You okay, buddy? No! The roads turned in the dirt. No idea what happened to it. No, no. He just learned that his actions have consequences. I realized the damage I've done. I probably killed the equivalent of a few hundred turtles. I must make things right. Dave realized the consequences of what he was doing and started the largest nonprofit organization the earth has ever seen. He felt so guilty from killing all of those innocent turtles and pollution. We'll see him out on the streets now picking up after himself, and more importantly, after others, and being an example of what it means to recycle. Dave's favorite piece of recycling is Pringles cans. He likes them because he gets to eat the crumbs out of the bottle, a luxury he doesn't otherwise enjoy, because he's poor. The earth has never been greener.